What's up guys and welcome to the vlog. I'm in the garage again. I'm going to be doing a couple things. One, I'm going to be setting up some brackets for my radiator for the V-mount setup in the RX-7. Two, I'm going to be respraying my intercooler. So I've straightened all these fins on this intercooler. It's looking a lot better than what it used to. And then I'm going to spray it a color that I know most people won't like. But this is the beauty of JDM cars. You can do whatever you like to express yourself. And this is going to be one of my things. So I'm going to have to degrease this thing first. Like I said, I've straightened all the fins, but I need to give it a good cleanup, so we need to do that quick. I'm not sure if you guys can see this on the camera, but there's glitter flying around everywhere. It looks so cool. That's why I can't talk. Looks so damn good after the second coat. So if you haven't figured out already, I'm going to be doing a gold and purple theme inside the single turbo FD. But I gotta go, we had some family over now, and I had to entertain for a little bit. So I gotta continue this another night. Uh, anyway, Gareth and John are here, we're gonna finish off the FD tonight. And what that means is, I can finally go get a downpipe, take the car on a flatbed to get a downpipe, and then drive it back home. So we're gonna finish this V-mount setup fully, get it in with the brackets. Um, we're gonna make some pipe work. What else are we doing? Mm. Fitting hoses. Wiring. Blocking up, and we're rewiring the fans. And removing some extra missing pieces. Yeah, there's a bunch of crap that's still coming out here. It's redundant, uh, they're gone already. No, only one's gone. There's brackets that we're taking out. And then we're extending this, because now the intercooler has moved flush up against here. And uh, we're just doing a shit ton of work just to make sure, oh yeah, we're relocating the AST. Getting this car ready for the downpipe and road ready. Does that sound? Mm. Not really yeah, getting it ready for the road. Hmm. That should work. Yeah. You want to take it off and put some lube on it? No, I think it's on. Okay. Yeah, incoming. Okay, I can't reach anymore. Um. I'll give you a pair of yeah. gas pliers. Five more mil, but it's quite okay. hard. I don't know if we should try. Yeah, why not? Do this a bit. No, this one up a little bit. Okay, guys, we just finished this pop here. This is how it's gonna look. Not. Gareth feels right at home doing his rub down here. I'm very professional at rubbing one out. <laughs> That's what she said. What he said. Yes, yeah, dude, your arms are flexing like <laughs> fuck. I did bar. You used to this. I did biceps today, so it's, uh, it makes sense. <laughs> Okay, so that pops out of the way. What are we doing next? Mock up the radiator. Put the radiator in place so we can start cutting the pops. So guys, um, we're gonna move the radiator, but now because it's upside down, my pipe work, I've got some cool purple looking pipe work that I bought before I knew I was going single turbo. And obviously that's not gonna work anymore. However, I'd like to keep the purple so there's only an extra bend that I need to do and I need to lengthen it slightly so I picked up this thing oh thanks to my old man he had it at his office and we're gonna cut pieces and extend this guy and there's another one there for the bottom or the outlet or whatever right okay, radiators in made some uh, makeshift brackets it actually works out quite well this thing's super steady in the front we need to make up some brackets at the bottom now there's the pipe that we cut up. We chopped off a piece, that piece, and we actually managed to get it on sitting nicely. We had to cut a piece off this radiator with a hacksaw blade somewhere in my bin. That. Cut that piece off. Now remember, this is all temporary until I get my V-mount radiator. But it's looking good. It means I can start the car, drive the car, get a down pipe made, bring it into the garage, and then fit a V-mount radiator in the months to come. So this straight edge, that piece, is going to go into two pipes at the bottom 
here if you can see that this one's sorted that one we're making a plan right now don't have an angle grinder and i told john not to bring his so let's try Guys, I'm underneath the car at the moment. We ran out of uh, spring clamps, and I remember that my gardener broke the outside broom, and uh, I didn't have a chance to go and buy a new one, so I put some clamps <laughs> on it. <laughs> and we're about to use those clamps underneath. And then I want to show you guys on the blog something. Not sure if you can see a fucking thing on here, but um, this is what it's looking like underneath the car. I've put this metal inside, it comes up like, to about here, and then there. Put a clamp there, put a clamp there. There's no kinks at all, and then this black piece going into the back of the radiator, and uh, super ghetto, but it's working. Like I said, this is a little temporary shit. Just need to get the car driving again so I can get the downpipe made. And then I'll get a proper V-mount radiator. You got enough? <laughs> Maybe. Making tracks here though. Yeah, I'm bad. If I had that uh, fan we could have finished up today. Which means I can't put the intercooler on now. Because we need to raise this shit to put the shroud. Don't judge me, I'm doing some serious backyard mechanic shit. Alright guys, uh, it's like almost 11 o'clock at night now. We decided not to pick up the camera for a little bit and just focus on, on what's at hand here. Radiator is sorted. So my temporary stock V-mount radiator is now fixed in place. All that shit's done. I've seen a clamp on there and a clamp on there too. Um, but we're good. Reroute pipe. Everything's sorted out. Got one more, what do you call it, soldering to do. But this is Jono's job. It actually came out sweet looking at OEM. So guys, I'm going to end the vlog here. Huge thank you to Jono and Gareth. Hopefully next time you see us in this garage with this car, it'll be running and I'll have a down pop. Thanks so much for watching. See you all in the next video. Peace. You're never gonna make it, you're not good enough There's a million other people with the same stuff You really think you're different, man, you must be kidding Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it It's impossible, it's not probable, you're irresponsible Too many obstacles, you gotta stop it, yo You gotta take it slow, you can't be a pro Don't waste your time no more Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove I'm gonna make my move, I'm gonna make it soon And I'll do it cause it's what I wanna fucking do Cause all these opinions and all these positions They come in in millions, they block in your vision But no, you can't listen, that shit is all fiction Cause you hold the power you're as long as you're driven